It's literally so doom and gloom outside and I just did my hair. Champagne problems. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So another self-care vlog. I need to get my nails done desperately. I had these like milky pink, milky white chrome nails and they've grown out. So I'm thinking to go back to French tips, just a classic French tip. Also, I got some new glasses. I really love them. They are Vivian Westwood and I love them. But yeah, let's go and change my nails. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm taking myself out to go shopping, which is going to be a nice little solo date. This is like my favourite thing to do alone, is go shopping alone. All the girlies we know that shopping by yourself is elite because no one's waiting for you. You can take 45 minutes to decide on something and you can take an hour in the changing rooms. So the reason why I need to go shopping is because I need to find a dress for polo. So maybe this vlog could kind of be like a um, polo prep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this video will be on polo prep and step one is finding the perfect polo dress so i'm going to house of cb i think it's the most perfect place to find like a nice summery bouncy classy dress high quality dress also don't mind the no lips right now it's because my wonderful boyfriend james is making us a breakfast wrap so i'm going to put my lip on afterwards i really want to show you the watch i'm wearing today let's do a little watch check of the day because watches are like my one of my favorite accessories so today i'm wearing this tag watch yeah i'm wearing this tag watch it's my boyfriend james's tag watch i don't know what it's called it's a bit big on me it's this really nice silver watch with a navy blue dial like mint green arms what do you call that what do you all the, like the little ticky things I really like men's watches or like men's style watches. I think that's like the tomboyish side to me. What I really love is like a simple, simple outfit with like a nice manly watch. So speaking of, I have this Vivian Westwood watch. I feel like it's giving men's watch kind of vibe. But yeah, I love the green dial on that with the two-tone strap. It's so nice. Maybe I can do a watch tour. Hmm. So if that's something that you'd be interested, let me know in the comments. I'll do a little watch tour. Yo, oh, I bought this. Hello. You're so cute. This is Peanut. <laughs> Hello, Little Luna. Stretch. Some coffee. Wow. So we have what do we have here, James? A breakfast wrap. A breakfast wrap with cheese, egg, and bacon. And we've got two ketchups. And James got this for me yesterday. This Filipino style banana ketchup. Which I absolutely love. I really pop this breakfast up. It's James's plate. Ooh. Oh my burnt egg. Right, I'm just waiting for some dresses to come. I've tried on two, but they've not been successful. The dresses were nice, but they weren't perfect. So I've just asked for two more dresses and I'm just waiting for them to come. The customer service here at House of CB is really good. They even give you heels to try on with the dresses, which is such a nice touch. So I'm yet to try on an actual nice dress for me to slip them on and see it for the full effect. I'm waiting on the Samaria dress, which is like my number one option. So I hope it's perfect. I hope it fits. I hope they have it. That is one one for polo. My two unsuccessful options. I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed but I need it in a smaller size. I have to say the sizing in House of CB is really inconsistent because some dresses are a medium, that fits perfectly, some dresses are a small and that fits perfectly, so it really depends on the dress. So right now I am waiting to see if they have the navy blue Samaria dress, which is sold out everywhere, but I'm manifesting that we can make it work and I leave here with a blue Samaria dress. I 
said yes to this dress and I want to order this dress, the navy blue, in my size and then we will decide why we're for polo. Okay guys, I'm back from shopping and I feel a bit hot and overwhelmed because I was on the train and there were football hooligans because it's what? Like the final, whatever it is. Yeah, it was just crazy. So one thing I have to say and complain about is I spend 200 pounds on a dress and their bags aren't even sturdy. Look at how I've had to carry this home. So what I had to do was when I was in Zara, I had to ask them for a stapler so that I could securely staple the remaining handles back onto the bag so that I could take it home. Isn't that crazy? You spend 200 pound on a dress and you can't even take it home safely. All in all, the customer service in House of CB was really good. You can pretty much just ask them for anything and they'll bring you any of the sizes, any of the styles if they have it in stock. And if they don't, they give you other alternatives. Yeah, I ended up going with the Marilyn dress, which is in here the Maryland dress and I will do a proper unboxing and try on. I will show you what I got in Zara. I popped into Zara and I wanted to get their basic um, like vest tops because I think they're just perfect for summer like it's just like a nice basic so I got this cream one. I was only meant to go to Zara for this. <laughs> Oops but I bought something else. But this is literally the most me dress ever. This is what it looks like. Can you see what it's like? Yeah, isn't this the most perfect baby blue? It's perfect. This dress is the epitome of how I want to dress every day. I am freshly showered and ready to go to the cinema. We had a lovely walk to just recenter because going into central London is really overwhelming and overstimulating with everyone's energies and stuff around but it was nice to just not take my phone and just get grounded again but now I'm fresh I'm wearing my new top that I got from Zara which I'm really happy about I'm gonna go watch the new apes film I don't even know like the name of it but it's part of the apes trilogy franchise whatever you call it that's been James and I's new obsession recently we're really lucky we live right next to the cinema we can literally walk there in like eight minutes so that's what we're gonna do tonight which i'm so happy about like for me going to the cinema is just like the most perfect evening plan and i think watching the apes film will be like really cool and to watch an experience in the cinema yeah i wonder how it's gonna go i actually would really recommend it if anyone hasn't watched it yet at first i was like mm, i don't know when james asked me to watch it but no definitely recommend it it's really good and i'm going all fresh faced skincare all of my serums and moisturizer because i feel like i'm in the phase just before i go on my period so everything is like flaring up give me spots and i'm just like swollen so i just kind of want to let my skin breathe look after it and just yeah do lots of self-care i love this going to the cinema just like barefaced um and in my comfies you better take any help you can get i'm burning i like you I've just picked up another parcel. Let's open it quickly because we're at a red light. Whoa. Gym top. Well, that finally goes at the bottom. Yeah, this is a Tala gym top. Oh my God, I'm loving this color of brown recently. It's so nice, isn't it? I like it. It's gonna match my coffee bean Adenola leggings. Oh my god, it's so stunning. I'm really happy with that. Tired girl. Right, I've just come back from a walk. I went to the office today and yeah, I was I was just stuck inside all day with dry air. So I was like feeling so suffocated and I knew I needed to like reconnect with myself and reconnect with nature. So I took Luna on a walk and it was really nice. And um, I also got a notification that the shoes I ordered for polo this weekend has arrived. So let's go and pick it up together. A little dress update. As you saw, I tried on all of these beautiful dresses, but none of them were my first choice, which was the Samaria dress in the navy. It's just so stunning, so classy, and also super versatile. 
because I can wear that to the polo, I can wear that on holiday. If I'm gonna spend 200 pound on a dress, it has to be the dress I wanted. So, because I literally spent like two hours in House of CB, I don't know, like subconsciously, I felt like I needed to buy something. So I bought the Marilyn dress, which I love. I love the Marilyn dress, but it's just, I feel like it's not polo vibes. Yeah, I'm gonna return it. I'm probably gonna go tomorrow after work and I will just wait for the Samaria dress to get back in stock and then I'll get that you know like for not for the polo because it'll be too late but i'll just get it for my general life because it's just such a stunning dress so anyway i don't think i vlogged it but i went to zara and i brought this other dress it's worked out to be my polo dress i didn't buy it for that reason but it just worked out that way i'm so happy i went for it i'm super excited about it because honestly the way i see the dress is me in a dress okay it's elegant it's classy but it's fun and it's cute and it's and it's sexy in like a classy way and i literally have the most perfect like cinderella blue manolos but again that's not giving like polo vibes but i will definitely wear that like to dinner one day or something because just the blues so cute so beautiful the shoes that i am actually going to go for are these um, wedges these gold wedges from plt which is so excited to go and pick them up i'm just waiting for james because he's finishing his like training hall thing but yeah we'll go afterwards me and my friend benita have been like texting all week texting each other our outfit options shoe options hair options and stuff all week and it's just getting me so excited i am going to go to my parents and i'm going to go and borrow my mum's pale yellow chanel bag which i think is going to go perfect with the light blue dress that i'm wearing oh, thanks mom and I will probably also raid my dad's hat collection because he's got such an insane straw hat collection. He's literally all about hats. I'm going to go raid their wardrobes probably on Friday and we'll put a look together. So more information on the polo. My friend Ellie from uni actually invited me. So it's going to be this big girls day out. She's going to bring her housemate. I'm going to bring Benita and my friend Jamie hopefully is coming too told her about it and she was down but she literally like forgot to buy a ticket so that's really annoying and wishing jamie all the luck that she does make it because it's going to be such a fun girls day out ellie's boyfriend's going to come as well but i just want it to be girly vibes and i hope he's just there to be like our bodyguard <laughs> it's in fulham i've never been to polo before but i love horses i love horse racing yeah i've always wanted to see the polo so super excited and i will probably vlog that too i'll take you along with me so that you can see what going to polo is like. And while I have you on here, I might as well show you something else I picked up the other day. So I bought these Free Society bikini bottoms because I bought this really just like simple triangle black triangle bikini from H&M, but it didn't have a matching bottom. Or it did, I just didn't like the cut of it. It wasn't cheeky enough for me. This is what I went for. This cream and black cheeky bikini bottom dog mom life and i also picked out some new flares because i've decided that my uniform is going to be flares lululemon style gym jacket and like a sports bra or like a nice sleek top underneath but yeah that's going to be my new uniform zara vest sports bra flares pretty much just like clean girl aesthetic but I'm gonna have like my own sporty twist to it. So yeah, I wanna show you the flares I got. They're from Gilly Hicks. I'm so happy with them. I absolutely love the cool like slate gray kind of blue color. And they're a perfect length for me, which is so rare because I'm 5'3". Guys, I have collected my parcel. Maybe I'll just set you up on here and we'll do like a quick unboxing. Oh. Oh. By the way, these are shoes for mm. the polo. Have I shown you what they are at all? Tabithas. Tabithas, no. Ready? Ready? <gasps> ah! Oh my god, look at them. <laughs> They're so glam. They are so, James, are you ready? Wow. These are wedges. Wedges. <laughs> yeah. Wedgetons. These are giving like Ibiza, if you know, you know. Do you agree? Does it give you that? Yeah, it does. <laughs> I'm literally so happy and I'm so excited to try them on at home. But yeah, I think it'll be a really nice, not contrast, but it, it's like something else to kind of add to the outfit that's kind of just like classy, elegant vibes. This brings in that like fun, young, sexy vibe to it. So yeah. Hey besties, welcome back. I've just finished doing my hair. It is one night before polo. I used straighteners 
to curl the ends of my hair and yeah I've just put them in rollers I will leave these in all night and then overnight sleep with these rods to kind of like hold them in place because I cannot sleep in rollers and anyone who can I commend you because it's just too hard but yeah this is how I did it because I washed my hair yesterday and I didn't want to wash it again and yeah I wanted to try something new and I've got my iced tea here this is just like the elite getting ready station I've got my iced tea made by my wonderful boyfriend I've got YouTube on right now I am watching like a noodles mukbang <laughs> I've been loving watching spicy noodle mukbangs recently so that's what I've been up to and it's just like so peaceful and quiet I had my shower shaved and now that I've finished my hair I need to go and fake tan otherwise I'm pretty much done let me give you a sneak peek of my bag dun, 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 dun. This is the wonderful bag that I'm borrowing from my mom, which I'm gonna wear tomorrow with my baby blue dress. I wish I could have shown you me doing my hair, but my camera was dead whilst I was um, getting ready. So I just did it and it was really relaxing that way. I will do a tutorial if, you know, if you want to know how I did my hair. Otherwise, I'm gonna end the vlog here before I go and do my fake tan. Thank you so much for getting ready with me for the polo and I will see you at the polo.